Yes or no? Oh. This wheel is going to determine all the Pokemon cards we buy. Yes or no on this Foy Coco box. Let's see. It is going to be a, oh, a yes. All right, so it looks like we have our first item. Oh, wait a minute. What about this Lucario V-Star box? Oh. It is saying, oh, no on that one. Farewell, Lucario. The wheel has spoken. And have a seat in the Jeep. In case you're curious, those are my shoes for today. Now let's go hang out at Target. All right, so at the very front of Target, they got a bunch of just like single packs and that is pretty much it. Now we still have to check the back of the store, but let's go ahead and uh, pick out a random item. Let's make sure that we're not missing anything down here, any of uh, like hidden or out of place Pokemon cards. I think, I think that's gonna be a no. Okay, so let's go with that mini binder album. Is it yes or is it no? Oh, oh. It's a yes. All right, so we're adding that to the Pokemon Hall. Uh, Silver Tempest, how about right, right here? Is it gonna be a yes or is it gonna be a no? The mystery wheel is saying no. But wait a minute, wait a minute, let's go. Let's go right over here. More Silver Tempest in the checkout lane. Is that a yes or is that going to be a no? It is another no. Okay, I wanna tell you something about Sour Patch Kids. What I usually like to do is I just kind of like eat the sourness off of them and then I'm, I spit the rest out. Trust me, you don't gotta tell me. I know I'm weird. Honestly, I'd rather be weird than, than normal. Let's do a quick Pokemon Squishmallow update. Do they have any? Oh, I'm gonna find those jumbo ones one day. Until then, tear. Let's check all the way down here at this Pokemon section. And they actually don't have a whole lot but they do have the last little corduroy jigglypuff. These are honestly like really nice. Okay, the search continues. I mean, there's obviously gonna be Pokemon in, in the candy area, right? I literally got excited for a second because I thought that was a Pikachu Squishmallow. It is not, however, but still an awesome Pikachu plush. Okay, I'm gonna go to another checkout lane and try to redeem myself. Let's go with the Kranidos one. Is it yes? Or is it no? Are you serious, again? Okay, we're going back up here to try our luck again, and we're gonna go Score Bunny at the very end. Okay, come on, Score Bunny, and? <sighs> How about the Score Bunny beside it? Is that gonna be a yes or a no? <laughs> one of these has to be a yes. Finally, that one. Let's try for, not this Silver Tempest, but this Silver Tempest right here. Do we have yes or no on that one? Oh, spin again, that's actually our first spin again. Here we go, are we gonna have a Silver Tempest? No. All right, the wheel has spoken. All right, take a seat in the Jeep. Also, if you're wondering, today I'm sporting a nice Score Bunny jacket from the Pokemon Center. It's not super cold outside right now, so I can go with a little bit of a lighter jacket. But now we are officially at another Meyer location, and this one, this one's been pretty good to us lately. However, this has not been too good to us today. Okay, walking all the way down here. Oh, they actually have some crown zenith. Okay, yes or no on the crown zenith. It is a, oh, it's a yes. Pikachu VMAX, you're being added to the Pokemon card hall. Oh, now wait a minute. Here is a bunch more. Oh, they even have a Fusion Strike three pack. One left. That means we only have one opportunity to get yes. Okay, Fusion Strike three pack we have. Oh, yes. And we'll add that to the Pokemon card hall. I'm, I'm not even gonna try, honestly. I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> we have opened up, I think, I don't know how many Charizard boxes on the channel, five? Now I know what some of you are thinking. Will I try yes or no on that? No, I'm just gonna say it right now, no. Okay, just for fun, let's just, let's just see what it would have said. And it would have said, it, that's exactly why I didn't do it. Let's see, we have some Pokemon Go up there. We have some more Pokemon Go. We got Bolton V. Honestly, let's let's try with Bolton V. Okay, spin the wheel and it is, oh, it's a no on the Bolton. And have a seat in the Jeep. One last stop. Yes, I know it's our third one of the day. I think I hit the jackpot breaking family because they are stocked here and I see Evolving Skies. So very first pack of Evolving Skies right there in that row. It's gonna be, oh, spin again. Okay, okay, I can do that. I can do that, spin again, and we have a yes. All right, that's gonna go right in the cart. Let's move over to the second row and see if we can get another yes with Evolving Skies. Oh, no, let's find a Sylveon. Oh, here's a Sylveon right here. Yes or no on the Sylveon booster pack. Oh, yes, and boom, right in the cart. They do have some of the Crown Zenith boxes as well as the Pikachu V, and they even have the tins at $20. Okay, let's try our luck with this Umbreon tin right here. I feel like it might be a good one. Oh, and even the wheel. Even the wheel 
said yes on this one and I know I left my hat in the car. It's a little awkward. And boom, right in the cart. Back in the studio, did the mystery wheel actually know what it was doing? We have a total of 21 booster packs to open up and we are gonna make an added challenge as well. We need a total of nine points. And how we'll get those nine points is every hollow rare is one point, and then ultra rares and above are two points. So basically anything that's not a non-hollow rare is worth a point. And that right there, breaking family, that is worth two points and a hollow rare ditto. So we got three points right there, breaking family. I think we can get a total of nine. And the reason why I'm going with the number nine is because Pokemon Day, that's right, official Pokemon Day is on February 27th. So two plus seven, hang on, there's some math in there. Hang on. I'll get it. Hang on, don't worry. That's nine. Nine. So that's why we're looking for a total of nine today. Breaking family, we got ourselves some gold. We got the Giratina on pack number two. Whoo! Oh my goodness. Okay. All right. I think this mystery wheel knows what it's doing. I think it knows what it's doing. Whoo! Okay. All right. Didn't quite expect that. Two packs in, but there it is. There it is, Breaking Family. All right, I'm stepping on the plastic right over here. Psyduck, thank you so much for being here, Slowpoke. Psyduck, love you as well. Woo! Oh my goodness, Breaking Family. Let's go ahead and uh, sleeve up the booster pack, or the, the card, I should say. Here we go. Woo! This is easily probably a lot of people's most sought after Pokemon card from Crown Zenith, and we literally just pulled it right now. Woo! Okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Energy, put that in the filing cabinet right back there. We also got to sleeve up the Electro, or uh, the Magmortor. Whoop! Right up there in the VIP section, which means we can officially add the VIP ropes with the all-you-can-eat bagel bites. That's right, the all-you-can-eat bagel bites. Go ahead and help yourself to some bagel bites. You are VIP as well. Five points. I think we're going to get those nine points. I think we're going to get those. Let's see if we can go above and beyond. Let's say 15 points. 15 points. All right. So if we get the nine, we'll try to aim for 15 after that. We got Aaron and Galarian Berserker as well. So no points energy inside of that booster pack. But Breaking Family, I want to say something to you. What is up, my Breaking Family? Send in some positive vibes in your direction. I truly hope you're having a magnificent day. Sending all the positive vibes, the good energy in your direction. If you're having a little bit of a rough day, I hope it truly gets better. And uh, you know what? Don't forget, tomorrow's a new day. There's two more points right there. Tomorrow is a new day. So if today's rough for you, then wake up tomorrow. Give it your best and maybe it'll be just a little bit better than today. And then you can do that a little bit every single day. And then you just have a magnificent day, finally, right? Because you just work up to that magnificent day. It's all right. It's all right. We all have rough days. I have rough days a lot. A lot of days I have rough days. So just never forget that tomorrow is always a new day. We got Wooloo going into Rare Candy and, and, oh, Heliolisk for our Rare Superstar. Next is the Boy Coco Pokemon Collection Box, the first item picked today. Let's start off with Brilliant Stars and see what we have in here. And thank you for being here. I know there's a lot of, th ooh, Tomokazu artwork. I know there's a lot of things you could be doing today. Hey, that's another point right there. I know, I know there's a lot of things that you could be doing today. And uh, the fact that you decided to hang out with me and the rest of the Breaking Family, I appreciate your time because I know your time is valuable. It's one of the, literally, it has to be like one of the most important things in the world is time. So I appreciate your time, Breaking Family. Trapinch going into Urshifu V. That is two more points right there, Breaking Family. We are easily, easily going to crush our goal. We have Star Raptor for the rare as well. Energy. I'll put that right back there. Code card once again. Let's go ahead and sleeve up the Urshifu. So what I am finding out. Whoop, is that uh, Mystery Wheel is probably the way to go. It's probably the way to go. I should probably use the spin the wheel uh, on all my Pokemon openings from here on out if this is what it's gonna be like. We got Keldeo and a Hollow Rare Dragonite. 
for our rare energy. I'll put it right back there. If your favorite Pokemon is Dragonite, let me know it down in the comment section. Going into the next Silver Tempest booster pack. This is pack number four from the Fue Coco box. We got, uh-oh, uh-oh. Going into Magirna, two more points. I think, uh, Superstar, I think we got, I think we got the nine points we need. Now we have the Fusion Strike three pack, which is three packs of Fusion Strike. I gotta be honest with you, I was probably most excited about this right here because, because, I am trying to finish Fusion Strike, and uh, I don't see a lot of Fusion Strike 3 packs just hanging out at the store, but this one was by itself. We gave it a home, even though, even, yeah, I know, I know, you don't want to participate. I was gonna, I was gonna try to involve you. I was gonna try to involve you, but I, that's what I thought, that you didn't want to participate. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Zora, Shelter, Klefki, and a Cursula for the rare energy. We got Battle VIP Pass, which sees a lot of play in competitive. And then our last Fusion Strike. Unfortunately, I don't think we are getting anything that we need for our Fusion Strike binder. But it was worth a try, right? We're having fun. And we got Cook with a Scorch for the rare energy. I'll put that right back there. And I say we go into these two Evolving Skies booster packs. Let's start with the Sylveon. And I was just discussing this with, um, with some of my friends at local Pokemon League. Uh, this week, I don't find a lot of just like regular single packs in stores anymore. It used to, stores would be loaded with them, and now it's just like nothing but tins and collection boxes, and I kind of miss the single packs because you could go in, I don't know if you remember back in the day, but there'd be those display boxes and just a bunch of different sets inside of those display boxes, and uh, you can get a nice variety. So, you know, if you get a three pack, obviously all three packs are the same set, but you know, you could kind of mix and match and make your own, right? So I kind of miss, I kind of miss that. And another, another Leafeon. All right, we got two Leafeons, two different Leafeons. That is energy. I'll put that right back there. No complaints whatsoever. Pulling an Eeveelution. Go ahead and sleeve that up. Whoop. Right up there in the VIP section. The very important Pokemon card section. Hang on, I got some trash here. Next up are two items that we got at Target. One of them being a mini binder album right there. Holds a total of 60 cards. Now, for some reason, the, the mystery wheel really, I guess really did not like Target because it was saying no to everything at Target. We got Clefairy, uh-oh. And a Charizard breaking family. We got a Charizard pull from our one Lost Origin pack. Well, actually, our, one of our two Lost Origin packs. We got Spear Tomb, Energy, hot, hot, hot with the Kanto vibes. Now, let's see if we could actually get those 15 points. Whoop. If we took a quick count really fast, two, four, six, I forgot to sleeve it, eight, 10, 12, 14, and then we got a hollow, which is 15, and then 16 right there. So we were even able to uh, accomplish the 15 that we tried to get. So mystery wheel is the way to go. Go ahead and uh, do the mystery wheel in your, in your Pokemon searches. That will unlock that for the Pokemon TCG Live, our second Lost Origin booster pack. And then after this, we have that Umbreon tin that we got at the last Meyer stop. We got Inke. Any Malamars? You see any? Nope. All right. All right. That's fine. And going into a Porygon Z. Energy. Hello? Nope. Wrong number. And Misfortune Sisters, very last. And now last but not least, we have the Umbreon 10 with a total of five different booster packs inside. We are gonna start off with the Battle Styles booster pack. I think I'm just missing one alternate art for the binder from this set. We have Kingdra going into a Conklador. Energy for the rare. And then we got the code card right there. Also, by the way, I am going to repeat this. I know I said it earlier this week, but Marie and I will be at Knoxville Regionals next weekend. So it's the, the weekend 25th, 26th, I believe that's what it is, but it's next weekend. 
uh, in Knoxville, Tennessee. So if you're there, stop us, say hi. We'd love to uh, sign your side ups, EVs, take pictures, have a pack battle, whatever it may be. Um, but yeah, we'll be there next week in Knoxville Regionals. They are sold out of spectator badges by now. So um, that I do know. So unfortunately, if you've not got your spectator badge, uh, unless you're competing, uh, you will not be able to get in unless you already have gotten a badge, right? So they are just sold out of spectator badges now. We got a Lady but we should be at Fort Wayne Regionals. Um, we're going to try to plan for a Milwaukee Regionals as well. And then we're really going to try to even do Portland uh, regional. So, all right. But Knoxville for sure next weekend. So hopefully I see you there. All right. Last booster pack. Let's end it all very dramatic like by doing the card trick. All right. Breaking family. We got the Build-A-Bear situation going on. We got a Phoebus going into Dweeble. We got Energy. Put that right back there in the filing cabinet. Going into Shelgon and Breaking family. We are ending on. Can I get a drum roll, please? Thank you. And Breaking Family, we are ending on. Oh, Challenge Flame, you ruined the party. Breaking Family, that's it for today's Pokemon opening. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out the rest of the videos right over there. We'll see you all in the next video. And don't forget, I love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.